This video will walk through how to use Project YES, Youth Empowerment and Support, an initiative by the Lab for Scalable Mental Health at Stony Brook University, in partnership with UT Teen Health at the University of Texas Health Science Center at San Antonio. Once you are on the main Project YES website, anybody can click on the red Start button at any time to take part in Project YES. Project YES has three different parts. First, users can choose one of three online activities to try, either in English or Spanish. Each activity is a 20-minute self-guided single session intervention, or SSI, teaching a different way to understand and cope with stress, depression, and anxiety. Second, Project YES users tell us how they're feeling and what they think of their chosen activity, both before and after completing their SSI. This involves filling out some anonymous surveys about your mood and any feedback you have for us about the SSI you picked. Third, Project YES users are invited to share their best advice for other teens who may be struggling. If you give us permission, we will post your anonymous coping advice in our Project YES Advice Center for others to learn from and to be reminded that they are not alone. This is what the Project YES Advice Center looks like. As you can see, lots of teens have already shared their thoughts on how to deal with mental health struggles. Here are some of the responses we've seen among Project YES users so far, based on anonymous surveys from the first 187 teenagers to try Project YES. From before to after completing their chosen activity, teens' hopelessness showed a 62% chance of decreasing Teens perceived control over their own emotions and their actions showed a 64% chance of improving. And teens' sense of self-hate or self-dislike showed a 55% chance of decreasing from before taking part in Project YES to after. You can read more about these findings in our lab's published paper in the Journal of Medical Internet Research linked below, which describes and reports findings related to Project YES.